So if you have this H101, chances are you have a servo problem. And if you don't correct the servo in time and you keep pushing it, what's gonna happen is one of these gears is gonna get stripped out. So this is how we can tell that your servo is bad or at least one of the gears is bad. So what happens is behind here, there's a motor and the motor is connected to this tiny little gear. When I put this in the water, you're gonna see this spin and it will turn this one but it does not turn that one. What's supposed to happen is this turns this, that turns that, and that turns this, which turns this, which turns this, which turns this, which turns this, and ultimately that turns. Don't ask me why there's so many gears. But basically, when we put in the water, only this gear will turn, and this gear will turn, nothing above it will turn. So, uh, we're gonna take it apart later, but you're gonna see that the gears here are stripped. But first, we're gonna put in the water, and you're gonna see this gear spin and this gear spin and nothing else. So we'll watch this very carefully. So what's blurry is where it's spinning. You see that? Not spinning, I'm dunking in the water, it's spinning. So none of the other gears are spinning, only the first two. All right, so we're gonna take this apart and you're gonna see which gear is stripped. Try to do this with one hand here. So this gear is fine. And it's actually this second one. And we're gonna see that very closely. This section of the gear is fine. And about maybe a th more than a third of it right here. This is all stripped. So that stripping comes from the servo arm not being centered out of the factory. And when you put the boat in the water, it starts making a buzzing sound because it's forcing itself into one direction. So the servo replacement is probably less than $5. I'm gonna have to kinda jerry-rig it to uh, be able to replace or connect this set of wires to a new servo. I'm not sure that's even worth the time or trouble. This thing has been a lot of trouble. Again, the H101. And that's it. So, time for a new servo. Haven't decided whether I'm going to buy a new one or ditch this all together.